Hello and welcome to the Teenage Market TV, a show all about giving young people a platform for their creative talent. I'm Tom Barrett, the organiser of the Teenage Market. We're bringing the show to you from the Teenage Market HQ in Stockport Marketplace. Coming up on the show, we talk to 14-year-old teenage market trader, Matt Tiplady, about starting his own clothing brand, Crazy Face. Legendary bass player with the Happy Mondays, Paul Ryder, talks to us about his teenage life. And the acoustic jazz duo Blank Check play us out with their song, Cover Band. But first, here's Matt Tiplady, who talks about starting his own business and being a trader at the teenage market. Hi, I'm Matt Tiplady, I'm 14 years old, and I run my own business called Crazy Face Urban Streetwear. Well, I came to the first teenage market and I was really inspired by all the businesses that all the teenagers have. And I was quite glad that there was someone there to support you and knowing that you could have your own store there. As soon as I came back from the teenage market, I went to my room and I was just drawing, doodling and stuff. And then I drew a load of different designs and one of them was a face. And then it just suddenly popped in my head, crazy face. So, and I was like, yeah, that's a good idea, I quite like that. But when I did the first teenage market, I was quite nervous. I didn't know what I was going to expect. So it mainly sold it to family friends in the first one. Then when I did the second one, I was like really pleased because I just sold it to anyone in Stockport. I was like, oh, this is well good, this. It's a really nice feeling just selling it to people. What you've designed, knowing that it would be in someone's house and some wearing it when they're skating and stuff. It was quite a good feeling. Well, my head teacher found out the other day that I'd do my own business and he was quite pleased about it so he invited me down to his office without telling me what it was about so I was like oh no what have I done and then um, it turns out he's going to help me promote my business and do photo shoots and stuff like that. Well, my ambition is to get crazy face around different skate parks around the country and get loads of little kids and teenagers obviously, just to get wearing his t-shirts. At the moment I'm sponsoring a ramp at Bones 3. It's a skate park in Stockport, really big skate park and lots of teenagers go down there. I'm sponsoring a wall there that's going to get my name out and look, the kids will see that Crazy Face is an urban street sports company so they can look it up on the internet or maybe go into a shop and buy Crazy Face t-shirts. Teenage Market has really boosted my confidence meeting people instead of just selling it online. I like, I like to meet people and like get talking to them about my own business. The other week I went down to Merseyway and I was selling my t-shirt and it was really busy and I sold quite a few t-shirts that day. So the Teenage Market is just, it's just getting better and better because it's going national now. So hopefully that can open more doors for me and selling it to new people who've never seen this before so it can spread the word quite a bit. Next we have My Teenage Life with the Happy Mondays legendary bass player Paul Ryder on the set of the upcoming Frank Sidebottom documentary Being Frank. Well I was going to say a rebel without a clue but I'd heard that somewhere else. I just thought it was funny. Uh, I'd like to think of myself as pretty clued up. I collected lots of punk stuff and, and the odd Thin Lizzy album. Um, but yeah, mainly mainly punk because that was uh, you know that was coming about when I was when I was uh, 14. I think it was four, 1973. I was 14. So when that hit the uh, when that hit the scene, it was like wow. Well, I like to think I was well dressed as well. I was uh, I was wearing uh, loose jeans, pods, uh, Fred Perry t-shirts. Um, uh, what coats? I would have had a coat because I like coats. Um, I can't remember what coat though, but yeah, that, that was that was my standard dress at that time. Probably. 
probably when my chain broke on my Yamaha FS1 when I was 16 and I had to push it all the way home. Um, and my mates was following me on their, on their uh, mopeds. And, uh, um, and that was pretty embarrassing. 14 years old, in the Arndale Centre in Manchester. Um, it was at a place called Deanery. Um, I had a job there, and uh, I, I, always, I always worked in clothes shops when I was, uh, when I was at school. 17 years old, passing my driving test on the first attempt. Open your ears. See more of Paul and the rest of the Happy Mondays on their 25th anniversary tour later this year. To close the show, we've got the extremely talented duo Blank Check playing us out with their own song, Cover Band. There's a blokester in the audience who's listening in He's knowing down the details and pondering On whether he could do the exact same thing But pass it off as is and make a million quid Flicking through the web and there's a cover of peace Counting down the hours till he comes unstuck A sound that seems to represent a parrot's tuck Shining to a pop-up in a children's book And robbery without consent So you took what you need and went And you're too lost to understand You're nothing but a cover band You take a step up to the microphone stand You jump start the ignition but the pedal gets jammed Ball's already rolling and the game's been played But you probably trick another in a couple of days And robbery without consent So you took what you need and went And you're too lost to understand You're nothing but a cover band So you took off without a trace And it's not like we were roommates It was more like a one night stand You're nothing but a cover band Without consent, so you took what you need and went, and you're too lost to understand. You're nothing but a cover band, so you took off without a trace, and it's not like we were roommates. It was more like a one night stand. You're nothing but a cover band. You can find out more about Blank Check on their Facebook and Twitter. We hope you've enjoyed the show and remember to tweet us at teenage underscore market and like us on Facebook. Also, check out the Teenage Market website where you can find out all the info on our big Teenage Market event in Stockport Market Hall on Sunday the 27th of October. It's a Halloween themed with fancy dress, so we hope to see you there. <laughs>